Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Backyard Bandits. So, last episode we took out the Victor. Uh, it did okay, I mean, I don't think it was the right situation for it to be in, but it did pretty good. I was actually surprised at how heat efficient it is with the uh, large VSPL laser in there. I mean, yeah, it was warming up and we knew it was going to warm up, but it was in a de desert situation too, so that kind of jacked it up a bit. Now we do have some stuff that I think we can add that are going to really help out. We need to find a weapons mount for the arm that's going to help out with bonus to hit on that thing. Um, so we'll have to make some work with that. But this episode, uh, once again, I want to apologize too that if you hear a fan noise in the background, it's just my computer, the bearings are going on the, uh, on the power supply. So I'm going to have to get that replaced. But I won't be able to do that until I'm able to move my office back into work. Uh, but anyway, uh, that being said, let's jump straight into a contract here. I know what we're going to do today. We're going to take Heavy Static here. It's a blackout mission. The last one we played worked out well, so I'm hoping this one doesn't kind of fudge out. Uh, I think Blackout's been having some issues, but I don't know. We're going to take it. It's three and a half skulls. Uh, it's against uh, House Merrick, um, and it's for the Pirates. So I, it's in the Badlands, so I think we'll probably be okay. I think our mechs are... Probably pretty good, pretty good for this one. We're going to go full salvage and hope we can get some good stuff off this. Free Worlds League's not going to like us after this, but... Okay, Syrah, Syrah is what I say. All right. Uh, all right, hot shot. Oops, sorry. It's been a while. Arachne, Queen Bee. And let's get the Archer, the Dervish, the Black Knight, and the Shadowhawk. And let's go do this. Yep, I know. Okay, here we go. Nighttime battle. Looks like we got some allies with us. If you want to call them that. Three vehicles and a chopper. What do we got here? We got the Drillson. What do you got on you? So you got to get close. Large laser. Parastherm sixes. Hmm. These guys all have to get close. MML7, I like PPC. Okay. So, that's the target zone. Uh, let's do this tactically. We're going to move the archer up here. On my way. And the dervish up here. Affirmative. We're going to ram the black knight down their throat. And we'll just walk, we're going to walk up here. Moving to position. There's no point in rushing it until we get into position here. I think this was the same map we did last time. Was it not? Yeah, it looks like it was. There was nothing in base one. There was a lot in base two. That could change though. Ooh, at least these guys are staying with us. That's nice. Alright, Hopper. Roger. Oh. We got some turrets. They're offline though. Moving out. Yeah, no point in uh, rushing this. So they might just bust out of those buildings at the back there. Let's keep going this way. Moving out. Moving to position. Roger that. Gonna keep walking it. No point in incurring instability unless we have to. At least they're keeping pace with us. That's kind of nice. I don't think we're going to find anything here. Uh, let's move Hotshot first. Nothing, huh? Alright, well, let's get down. On the move. Watch that flank. On the move. Watch that flank! I think the last time we did this battle, we didn't have any allies with us. Okay. Uh, looks like we're clear, so let's move on. Good to go. I mean, do we have to stand? We don't have to stand right on that, do we? Copy that. On my way. Okay. 
Okay, well. <laughs> okay. You guys want to fuck around? Uh, pair of Thunderbolt 15s, pair of VR mediums, medium laser, diverse optics. Yeah. Yes, Commander. Let's see how you optically you're diverse. Let's see uh, how optically diverse you are after this. What's this guy? Hunchback. Um, pair of LRM 10s with Artemis. Two medium pulses. Which one of these is guys is more dangerous here? Thunderbolt 15s are big damage. Let's go after the big damage. Splatter damage is meh. We can we can uh, shirk off the splatter damage. Oi, punk ass. Um. Wow, really, eh? I want to heat this guy up. Artemis, huh? Yeah, see, he it's so annoying. No, let's just go standard rounds. I'm gonna leave this one off, though. There's no point wasting that those rounds on this guy. Yeah, we're not gonna get much out of this because they haven't moved yet, right? So. It's kind of shitty that they drop in at the end of the turn, and then they have all this evasion. That's just kind of bullshit to me, but whatever. You need more practice. What do we got over here? Awesome. Well, we got to keep that guy heated up. Uh-huh. Now these are our, these turrets online? Yeah, these are our turrets now. Beautiful, at least we got something. This is gonna be interesting. Get a melee? Yeah, you know who the, who, you, know, you know who the threat is. Okay, B. Standing by. You know what your job is. Uh, we've had issues with being too close in the past, so let's get to here. Prepping for jump. So let's get the flamers on this guy and the barrage. Look at the barrage chance to hit. It's beautiful. Target locked on enemy's rear. Got one hit. No big deal. Alright. He's going to get shots off. There's not much we can do about that. Well played, though. He goes on 16. Our Black Knight goes on 15. Looks like he's got a chance to shoot us in the back too, which is a bad thing. Come on, buddy. Hammer this guy. Oh, nice hits. Well, the Avatar's moved already, so... We should probably move the archers so his back's to the wall and then drop some incendiaries on this guy. I think that's what I might do. And then I might have the Black Knight move over to clean up the uh, the Avatar and the, um, the Hunchback real quick. If we can keep that um, the Awesome tied up and overheated while we burn through these other three mechs. Then we can try and pull them apart and take what we, what we want from them. I want the pieces from them. Yeah, thought so. Doing a good job of um, maneuvering themselves so they can't be shot more than once in the back. That's it's nice. You know, the old days they would either turn or fire or walk forward and just keep shooting. But now it's like, you know, he's actively trying to get out of my range of shot. I mean, good for me because now I can move the Black Knight and not have to worry about being shot in the back, but... Still, now I can't shoot this guy, unfortunately. And that's where I think the T-Samp cannon might have come in handy. Although it's going to rely solely on if we can hit with the thing or not. 
And with those low chances to hit, I don't know whether we would rather have six flamers, because the flamers are only one tons, six flamers with low chances to hit, or one T-cent with a low chance to hit. I don't know. It's a, it's a, you know, six of one half dozen of another. If I had more weight, adding the T-cent would be a no-brainer, I think, but I don't know. We'll have to look at it. It may mean pulling the Warfare Suite out too, right? So, I don't really want to do that, but it's a possibility that we may have to do that. Is that, uh, no, he's not out of range. Let's move into here with our back to the wall, get our stability back. And then, what's our chances here? Oh my god. I mean, we could just shred the raptor. What's our chance on this guy? Let's find out here. 23 though. It's be, yeah, it's the same with incendiary. We're not going to be adding all that much heat. He's out of the battle right now, so let's look at pulling out... Let's switch back to uh, Artemis. Let's look back at this guy and see if we can pull this Raptor out of the battle. Two medium VSPLs, that's a lot of damage. And a taser. Yeah, let's go ahead and give it to this guy. Alright, good damage, but not enough. That was a critical hit, lad. We still got Arachne, though. I'm going to sick the Black Knight on these two. Beautiful. Keep that guy tied up. Alright, Hotshot. Okay, so our right side is the side with the heavy goss. I just want to make sure that we don't have that facing the awesome. Holy crap. I mean, really? God, this mech. Let's go for the shred. Oh. See ya. One more for the kill. Alright, we got our turrets coming too. That's nice. Did that raptor fall? No, he's still standing. Oh, fuck off with that. Lucky bastard. That was a solid hit. Oh, yeah. All right, Arachne. Commander. Let's uh, heat this guy up if we can. When does a hunchback go? 17? Hopper goes on 18. Queen Bee goes on 18. Okay. We got two guys before him. Let's move down to you. Let's go this route. Here it comes. He's got a barrage coming too, so you get some heat from that. So I think that awesome's successfully pretty much tied up. Unless he's got coolant flush or something along that line. Let's go with standard on this guy. I'm just going to fire straight out. That's a side shot. We could move around back. Probably a better way to go. Might as well. This guy's want to jump us. Well, that's what you get. Roger. Take that as a lesson. Yes, Commander. All right, let's get back over here. We burned through this guy's side already, so let's get over here. Is that going to be in range? Short range? Probably. Nope, it's not. Lifting off. Let's 
Just short, but that's fine. Burn him. Nice. Yeah, I gotta say, um, I know the last uh, version of Rogue Tech, uh, Project B, I think it was called. Um, it was really the laser builds that won out on that. I mean, yeah, you could have... That guy's gone. You could have a variety of different builds if you wanted to, but or like the Ultra Auto, like the Ultra Auto Cannon uh, 5s. Um, but really, the laser builds could kind of win out. But now, it's like having a mixed... mixed um, arms really really pays off it's nice to see that now they've kind of made some balances they've returned also they returned the damage from medium lasers back to 25 from 20 ready for orders uh, all right hotshot let's see if we can uh, What's your chance to hit from back here? I don't think the... Uh, oh, the Snub Goss can hit. What do you know? Wow. Um, I'm going to OP this guy. I don't want to kill him. Let's just see if we can get it. A couple of leg hits. All right. When are we going to make him bail out if we just keep overheating him? There's some artillery. There's the barrage. Order. Hardcore, you know the score. Heat him up, girl. No idea how hot this guy is. Drop him like he's hot. Okay, incendiaries. Roger. Come on, man, just bail out. You know you can't win. That was a critical hit, lad. Yes, Commander. Come on. Uh, let's leave this off. And leave this off. Go after this leg. Roger that. Ah, damn it. Reporting critical hit. Well, I don't know. Let's just go for the kill and move on. I'm sure we got more to fight. Want to get too close to you. Vigilance. Let's heat him up. Affirmative. Oof. Come on, man. Bail out. You don't want to be here. We don't want you here. Just give up. Bail out. Everything will be fine. Is he still dropping a ton of heat? I think he is. No, not really. Come on, Bubba. Yes, Commander. Bail. Just bail out. Well, at least he's stressed now. Maybe Hopper and uh, Queen Bee can force him to bail. Just gonna park it back there, huh? Might as well. Awaiting orders. Don't get too close. Copy that. The only reason why I say that is because of friendly fire. Confirm. Okay, he's almost shut down. Okay, he's dying. He's got nothing left. Is 
you going down? Nope. Yep, he is now. Okay, we gotta keep going. You've got my attention. Let's just sprint through here. I am moving in. Receiving you. Let's continue our aye, investigation. Aye. All right, let's go, guys. Affirmative. Copy that. Acknowledged. Let's get you back over here. God, this lamb is so good. <laughs> lamb is so good. Come on, allies. Did it so good in the last battle. All right, I heard a beep. Turrets, okay. Um, yeah, let's just go this way, I guess. Roll to that. Position confirmed. Let's just keep moving you up this way. Confirmed. I think I'll have her brace next turn. Get rid of the instabilities. She's a well, Maybe she's not. In, I don't think she's in jumping range quite yet. Yeah, I think she probably is. Um. Hmm. Let's go up this way. Roger. With the artillery mechs. Locking in coordinates. Uh, you got one instability, so let's just brace. Copy that. It's kind of shitty that you can't force her to walk and then get your stability back during these turns. And when you jump, you don't get the opportunity to brace, which is kind of shitty too. I guess these guys are staying in their base? I guess so. Let's get up here. Let's get the tank in. Let's move. Affirmative. All right, now we're in a good jumping range. We should be able to hit the back side of this. Yeah, you guys just stay back there. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I shamed him into moving forward. Uh, okay. Um. That just bothers me right there. There's nothing there though, so it shouldn't bother me. Let's do this. Moving out. Gonna get you to brace there. I will keep my heat down. I'll keep your heat down anyway. Okay. So Can't hold out much longer, eh? We've got contacts incoming. Of course they do. Can I finish my movement, please? Move Let's get you forward. We've got guys down here. Apollo. Okay. So. Ooh. Blackjack. Apollo. Wraith. And a griffin. Alright. Not too bad. What do you say we share some love with these guys? So who hasn't moved yet? Apollo. He's got a pair of long fires. We should probably shoot at him so he's not going to shoot at the base. Let's just go with uh, standard ammo. And drop some missiles on this guy. On. Hopefully he won't shoot at the base. One must survive, four remain. Commander. Who's this guy? 
that's the wraith, right? Confirmed. F the wraith. F the wraith. Man, I remember the wraith from, uh, um, what was it called? Oh my god, my brain's dying. Stargate. That was kind of an interesting race. Of course, still standard humanoid, but the, uh, the concept behind him I thought was kind of interesting. Okay, Hotshot. Standing by. Let's uh, show them the world of pain that they've uh, walked into. Griffin's move, so let's give him a let's give him a let's give him a, a big snub nose PPC welcome. What do you say? Ooh, not so good, but we're gonna take it anyway. Uh, and just fire. All right, well, no big deal. Got a little bit of acid on him. At least he knows what he's up against now. Okay, the blackjack's moved. That's an interesting loadout. Talk to me. Move forward a little bit, buddy. Let's get on this blackjack. We need everybody targeted. So let's just use standard for now. Damn you for making me do this. Well, he's gotta die. Gotta go down hard, you know what I'm saying? I like this blackout. I think the mission's great. I think it's set up well. As far as the uh, the enemies, I don't know. I'm kind of weirded by the uh, the balance. Not being able to select the difficulty of your enemies is kind of a little weird. Oh, good thing you didn't hit me. Oh, you're determined, you bastards. Okay. Alright, you want to play that game? We can play that game. Ooh. Now the Apollo, I think, is... Isn't that the 55 ton, basically, Archer? If I'm not mistaken. Wow, man, the Defenders. Hit there. Yeah, well, our allies really aren't that great, so. Yeah, these guys are going right for the base. Can we get a direct line of sight on this guy? I want to shred him. We can't. Uh, let's move forward, though. Ah, uh, I don't know. Better chance without it. How's the Griffin holding up? Light Goss, LRM-10. This guy's got tons of armor still. Let's take our best chance to hit and go after this guy. Man, just watching that armor peel off him. No knockout blows. Hopefully we can get one from uh, Hotshot on this Wraith here. Come on, you guys, get up here. Fuck me, these guys are doing a job on our base. I don't know if we can stop them. They've decided to not shoot at us at all. So, I don't know, I don't know if we got the firepower. All they gotta do is take two buildings. You got one back here and one up here. Small and small. Oh man. We need to hit with that with that heavy goss. There is no two ways about it. You've got my attention. I don't know if we move. If we move, our chance to hit's gonna drop. 
but we need to kind of get closer to be able to go into direct fire mode. All right, we got to do it. 47 on the griffin, huh? Going to warlord it. Let's go after the griffin. Roger that. right through his armor. Shake it, not stirred. Have a seat, buddy. Well, it's just as good as a kill. Commander. In my mind, anyway. That wraith is like... What's up, buddy? I get you. On the move. How's it hanging? Let's hammer this guy. Oh, <laughs> that never gets old. <laughs> Target neutralized. <laughs> that never gets old. Oh man. Fuck. Well, you got three of them. Okay. Commander. Okay. 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 We're gonna get hit by artillery again too, but. I think the other guy, I mean, we've got a better chance to hit on this guy, but I think this guy, if we can overheat him and stop him from shooting, that guy's down and out pretty much. This guy doesn't have any heat on him at all. Let's go after this guy. Firing at enemies. Got the barrage on him. All right, a couple more. 30 heat, beautiful. That should slow him down from moving. At least he won't get direct fire. That guy's going to die. Yep. At least they're not hitting me this time. Nice. God damn it. Why do they get to move first? Shit. Okay, we have to kill the black. We have to kill the, uh... Orders. Fuck me. Can we get a direct line of sight on them? Can on that guy. Shit. We need to kill this guy. Uh, everyone else goes before him. So let's get the archer. We got a direct line of sight. We're going to switch over to Artemis. We're going to shred the Apollo. I think that's the best route for this guy. Handheld MRM up. And let's hit him. Both lasers hit. Beautiful clustering. Nice. There goes his whole side. Hit, lad. Nice. Should be able to pull this off, in theory. We go before the Black Knight, so he's the one that's going to take the Goss. I haven't decided who Arachne's going to shoot at yet. Okay, he's gone down. Beautiful. Hot shot. Got something you want done? Yeah, you know what needs to be done. Dude, come on. You don't even need to ask me. Oh god, this guy's dead. Let's show him how we do things downtown. I got it. <laughs> two for two. Enemy down. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, you know what to do. What's he got left here? 85? Let's just go after it. Firing on target. Opening bails out. No. Nope. Come on, bail. Our allies are going to kill him. If that, the barrage will do it. Come on, Cobb. That's the chopper. Yeah. I was going to say, come on, Copter. There you go. 
I love how it just delays ever so slightly before it hits. Just on the outside. Copy that. Now she shouldn't take any damage because she's got her toes outside. Let's burn this guy. He's gone. There you go. Wow, we got lucky on that. Is that it? Oh, that's it. Beautiful. I think if the enemy had decided that each one of them chose a building and tr decided to split fire, that may have turned out a little differently, but I think we got lucky on that one. Black Knight, three kills. Oh, man. Beautiful. Good XP on this, too. All right, let's see what we get here. We got five picks. Eh? Avatar, 70 tons. That's probably going to be our choice, but let's have a look down here. Light Goss Rifle, LRM Long Fire. We're not having dis problems with our distances, so we're okay. Taser, so damage three, that's four tons. Haywire, EMP, and Impair Move. Reduced by 40% for two turns. Accuracy reduced by minus two for two turns. That's a possibility, too. We got we don't need these um, double heat sinks we'll probably pick up some of those anyway light goss ammo uh, wow four four tons of LRM Artemis ammo I'd love to replace the standard ammo with this so that's a good possibility as our fifth pick and I think that's gonna be it yeah so we'll take that and then we're gonna take the avatar I think we only got one awesome piece, unfortunately. We got three pieces of the avatar. Oh, really? It was not four? Well, then we can go one, two, three, and the awesome piece, I think. I think we, do, I think we have to go that route. There's not a lot down here that I think we absolutely have to need. The taser is interesting, but we got the T-SAMP right now. I know it weighs more, but I think it does, it does uh, better damage and everything. And then we'll roll the bones and see what we get here. Okay, we got a hunchback part. A raptor 2, raptor 2 part. ER large. Now, we got one of these. I don't know if we need this one. Let's hang on to it. A pair of light goss rifles. We'll hang on to those because we don't have any. And I don't know if we're going to use these. The weight, 12 tons. I don't know, man. The range is nice, but I don't know. For 12 tons, it just seems like it's a waste. Uh, we'll hang on to those because of the range, but we don't need that. Hang on to the Thunderbolt for now. We'll hang on to these. Oh, double heat sinks. Nice. Jump jets can go. Powered sensors we'll hang on to. Taser ammo we'll hang on to. And the Thunderbolt we'll hang on to. Okay. So not too bad, I guess. Not too bad. Not as good as the last mission, but not too bad. All right. Let's see what we did. 11,000 in damages. So that's really nothing. So, yeah. Pretty good. We did pretty well overall. The Wow. The... Um, Black Knight didn't even get hit. This was friendly fire, and this was because we got dropped on attack from behind. So, pretty good overall. I mean, they did really focus fire those buildings on that last mission, um, which saved our armor. We could have probably done this with the other lands too. Maybe I don't know. It was a tough. It was a tough call in that last one. If they, had, like I said, if they had really focused those buildings, we could have been in in a lot of trouble. I mean, they did focus them, but if they individually focused a bit different buildings, they probably could have taken them down before we had uh, were able to pull them all down. So, all right, I am going to end this episode here and flick on my AC and get some get cooled off a little bit. Um, going to try and record a few more episodes today. Uh, it's Saturday the 11th, I think it is, um, and get some recorded for next week so we have some. I'm also going to be trying to do a. Uh, Another Chem Priest episode for the Seven Days to Die. That hasn't ended yet either, if you guys are wondering. That's still going on. Um, I just need to uh, get the time to do it. It's, it takes a lot longer to record than this does uh, and to edit. So um, hopefully I can do that this weekend. But um, yeah, I'm going to leave this episode for now. I'm going to go and I'm going to try and get that T-Semp cannon into the T-Semp cannon into the Burkut. Now that we've got enough money to make our financial report, I'm going to see if I can get that Burkut updated. We got some time before the end of the month too. We've got, what are we at here? 25 days. Oh yeah, we got enough to get everything back, I think. We'll leave the mortise out for now um, and try and get everything back. 
Uh, we do have another bushwhacker we can assemble and put together and bring forward, which I think I want to do and replace the Min Shen. Um, so I'll look at seeing how much that's going to cost too uh, between episodes and see if we can bring that forward either now or next month, like next game month that is. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did drop a like, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And as always, you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.